going everyone? It's a brand new KT Pop vlog series. Today I went to an 80s cup sleeve event to celebrate Yosang, San and Mingi's birthdays. The event was located at the Happy Town K-Pop Cafe in Melbourne. Here's me walking to the cafe. Actually, quite a nice day considering it's July and winter in Melbourne right now. This event was organized by the amazing Melbourne 18 crew and honestly, it was such a vibe. They smashed it. Look at all the cute wall decorations. They have this mirror where you can write little messages. There's a little outfit check for you all as well, holding my freebie bag. Speaking of, look at all of these. Whoa. I especially liked the little Yosung planter card. Adorable. You usually buy a drink and a snack in order to get the freebies. So I got this pineapple aid. They are so freaking delicious. And also a not so delicious cookie that I bought only for the sticker. It did not go to waste though because Megan loves them. They also have this massive screen where they played 80s for four hours straight. Love that. Now, this is something I hadn't seen before. A photo booth type setup to take pictures with a themed frame. So cool. We managed to score a table so Caitlin and I could open the Yosang birthday merch we saved for the event. There's Megan eating her cookies. So here's an unboxing of that. I may get slightly emotional, so please don't make fun of me. Oh, now I'm scared. It's not gonna... It's such a bad sticker. I like a sticker. <laughs>
sick dog. Wait, but also the arm? Yeah, that's my dog. How is his arm so massive? It's like double the size of the dog. <laughs> that's actually like a German shepherd. Hey, UPS, you can open. Oh my god. Oh my god. Cards for birthday merch, isn't it? Oh my yes. god, wait, there's three. So much going on. And these little, I don't know what these Ooh. Are. Little stickers, I guess. Oh my god, these are so. Why so many hands, Yossa? <laughs> it's for you. Why so many hands? brought me a print of her newly completed Yosang art. Look how talented she is. I fucking die. Everyone loved the planter. <laughs> Everyone loved the planter. I don't know what else to call it. Here's a close up of all the freebies displayed and some of the cafe items for sale. They do lots of different group events here, so check it out. 
We worked up an appetite and decided to go to the Icon store for lunch. It's a cute new Korean style convenience store where you can cook ramen and eat it there. So many choices. I stayed pretty basic and got an iced Americano and classic Shin ramen, but with some added corn. Yeah, full splashed out. Look how cute my friends are cooking their ramen. Now on a mission for dessert, we ran into these cute pandas advertising one of the 6,000 tea stores in Melbourne. We were obsessed. Dessert found, we headed into Blue Whale. I got this Oreo waffle cone. It was so sweet, but the bubble waffle tasted amazing. We then returned to the cup sleeve to see if any of us won the raffle. Spoiler, we didn't. But instead, here is a video of my friends watching their husbands in HD. Time to hit some stores. We stumbled upon this random as fuck capybara store. It literally played the capybara song on repeat and sold the weirdest stuff. Then we hit Pop Mart and bought Jackson Wang blind boxes that we definitely didn't need. Unboxing two for the day. I love how you already have them on the way into life. Yeah. I got the cruel version, I love it, and now I want the entire set. Dinner time, more food. We went to Chicky Chicky and I got a spicy veggie tempura bowl. Can't go wrong there. Even though we didn't win the raffle, we were actually given that Byung Ming, which will go to our friend Danny. Oh my God, that was a good day, but I just got that soaked walking home. I look like a drowned rat. Here's a little rat. Yellow. <laughs> Baby girl.